In recent years, China's dominance in the Indian Ocean region has been cause of concern for India. Indian Navy has been working towards building the network of anti-submarine warfare to counter Chinese threats and especially its submarines. The Navy's anti-submarine warfare consists of PHI Poseidon maritime patrol aircraft, MH-60R Romeo helicopters and MQ-9 Sea Guardian drones. The one striking similarity between all these technologies is that it's a US based technology which means they can easily communicate, coordinate and work together in tandem. Indian Navy is planning to acquire a total of 18 P-type Poseidons, 10 MQ-9 Sea Guardian drones and 24 MH-60R Romeo helicopters. We have already made a detailed video on a defense deal worth 3 billion US dollar for the acquisition of 30 MQ-9 drones for tri services and the link for the same can be found in description section and the information tab. Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Today we are going to discuss about the latest update on MH-60R helicopters. We will try to understand what is this deal all about and how it will improve India's deterrence in sea against China and Pakistan. Talking about this deal, India and US has inked a deal worth 2.6 billion US dollars to acquire 24 MH-60I helicopters during Trump's visit in February 2020. The deal includes 24 MH-60I helicopters, communication systems, submergible sonar weapon systems, 8 anti-surface hellfire missiles which are used to destroy ships and other surface targets, MK-54 lightweight torpedoes, 50 cannons and precision rocket system. The MS-60 Romeo helicopters will replace the British-made Sea King helicopters that New Delhi acquired in 1970s. The MS-60 is famously called as Romeo and is known as helicopter that can hunt submarine deep inside the ocean. Talking about its capability, the helicopter plays a crucial role in maritime surveillance and submarine detection. The MH-60R Seahawk helicopter is the world's most advanced maritime helicopter. It is the most capable naval helicopter available today designed to operate from frigates, destroyers, cruisers and aircraft carriers. The helicopter can be fitted with torpedoes and missiles and are expected to bolster the Indian Navy's anti-submarine warfare capability in the Indian Ocean region considering that China has deployed submarines and other warships to establish its dominance in the region. Talking about its delivery, it is planned to start from early 2021. As per the latest update, India is expected to receive the first batch of three fourth generation MH-60R Seahawk helicopters between June and September. The MH-60R is already in service with the US Navy, Royal Danish Navy, Royal Australian Navy and Royal Saudi Naval Forces. Greece is also now in process of acquiring Seahawks for its naval fleet. The Seahawk deal was cleared by Cabinet Committee on Security CCS ahead of the former US President Donald Trump's visit to India last year. The helicopters are being acquired via direct government-to-government -government foreign military sales FMS route. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.